Hey, man, y'all know what time it is, man. Y'all tune in. Come on in, man. Come on in. Y'all come on in. Y'all know what time it is, man. I want y'all to come in and uh, hit that like button, subscribe. Y'all know how you do it, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's get this thing going, man. Let's get this thing jumping. Let's get this thing cracking, man. We're going to keep on laying down the game. And uh, we going to keep on moving, man. Y'all know how it go. Say, man, I want to say this here, man. Chad Newton, Tennessee. Shout out to Chad Newton, Chad Newton Tennessee. Uh, and I want y'all to understand something, man. It's all good, man. It's all good, man. And we continue to travel the world, putting down a good game. And guess what? We keep on blessing platforms out the platforms, man, so they can be able to monetize. And, uh, man, I, we went on a podcast, man, and I want to say it was a great podcast, bro. And we had dropped down a good game. But now on this, on this, you know what I'm saying, I'm giving y'all a sneak peek. I want y'all to check it out and let me know what y'all think about it, right? The full interview going to be on... Uh, Gotta Eat, Gotta Eat Podcast. You know what I'm saying? So y'all go check it out, man. It's gonna be the full interview, man. Y'all gonna have to go check it out. But uh, it's gonna be the full interview. But right now, this is a nice part of the interview. And I wanna know what y'all think about it, man. You know what I'm saying? Cause everybody been having, saying what they wanna say about, you know what I'm saying? What went on with uh, Brother Love, uh, and let's hear, let's hear, let's hear what my boy, Young Charlie, got to say about P Diddy. Let's, li let's, let's listen to what Charlie got to say. All right. Now he came up with a different perspective. Oh, matter of fact, let me not say nothing. Let me know what y'all think. Think P Diddy did what he did, what they say he did. <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah, they lied on P Diddy. They lying on yeah, P. Diddy. Nah, they lying on P. Diddy. Man, yeah, they lying. Because, uh, this is the first time I heard somebody yeah, say Yeah, yeah, they, they, because it's a nigga saying he did it. Yeah. You just like when the whole yeah. say, niggas whole say no say, man, yeah. that whole lie. That nigga lying too because he was a participant at one time. Right, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and, and ain't nobody coming out saying Diddy, uh, was forcing Diddy dick in him. <laughs> nigga Diddy is a great dancer. He know how to wiggle and jiggle across the stage. Yeah. I'm sure he can naked. He can wiggle and jiggle across the bedroom too. We don't want no kind of drugs. Nigga, ain't nobody coming out for Cassidy saying I was done wrong in, in these sex expert campaign. Right. And, and then she she was a participant. Nigga, she was down with the get out. She right. just said it was a disgruntled hoe that done turned into a rotten bitch that done got mad and wants some get back. But when she was the happy yeah. hoe, when she was the happy yeah. hoe, they were having fun with the Sean John. Yeah. Shit, yeah, it's just when the hoe get this wrong. Just like yeah. the this wrong employee who want to sue after they get mistreated and fired. But long when they got the job and can kind of take extra breaks and still, yeah, they, they ain't complaining. As long as they get fired, they want to sue. So it's the same thing. This girl the hoe and turn into a rotten, angry bitch that wants to get back. Did they lock them up? They ain't done nothing to them. They okay, put the kids so in the handcuffs. Up. Uh, you know, they intercepted a few planes, but man, listen, uh, the nigga, all I heard a nigga being accused of is, uh, uh, geeking and freaking. I thought it was like some R. Kelly shit. Ain't, ain't no kids came out and said nothing about that nigga. It's, okay. a, it's a nigga, it's a nigga, it's a nigga saying, man, Puffy used to do this to me, and he, we used know. to do this to that nigga. Man, that's just a bitch going on him, nigga, Puffy got ain't, ain't nothing wrong with having no motherfucking sex work. We now we ain't finna try to make it, make them see ain't nothing wrong with paying motherfuckers to fuck them. Nigga, that's always been an yeah. a, a ideal job to have. <laughs> a hoe get paid because she's pretty. She can go on yachts and shopping and man's yeah. trip and get paid good money and get calmed on. Now, I don't know when they start peeing on him and doing the type of shit he was doing, but we don't know what a billion dollars make a nigga want to do with that dick. Right. We ain't never had a billion dollars. So we can't no. fault that man and judge that man right. for mistreating his sex work. We don't know what a billion dollars is going to make that you woman want to do either. Man, yeah. yeah, she might be with it. They with it. You ain't heard now. You ain't it. heard now. I hope complain with Cassie. But the only reason Cassie complain because she got a new nigga with no money. 
And he done tried to He done come cocked an idea. He done put a little pimp in the He done sick the bitch on the nigga. And you know how it go with nigga. How many times you gonna sick the bitch on the nigga? We gotta be like all kind of shit to shoot at that nigga. Yeah. Get that goddamn money. Yeah. Man, I'm coaching this whole hot nigga. Oh, yeah. Knock him yeah. to the banana peel up under this nigga's mentally tripping ball. <laughs> but nah, man, you can't get mad at nigga for how he treat his hoes, even if his hoes is niggas too. Yeah. So who raised a puff? <laughs> they call that gorilla pimp. He be paying them motherfuckers. Yeah. They, get, they, they get to drink champagne and go on yachts and travel around the world and dance with celebrities and get to get a billion dollar pissing shower. Who get to get a billion dollar pissing shower? <laughs> <laughs> Me and my brother, and they go be able to tell this story and get paid for it one day. Right. Me and the first change ain't a robbery. Puffer ain't done nothing wrong. Right. Only thing he done wrong was sending that little girl Cassie across the, them seas uh, full of drugs to go fuck your mother millionaire rich ass motherfucker cause they wanna fuck the nigga bitch. That's that's the only reason he Damn. that's the only reason they fucking with him. Man. Good he game. had her going across the sea. Good game. Yeah. Good game. Next, Mr. Charles. Man, what's the update on you and get it a kid, man? <laughs> uh it might be a kid. <laughs> <laughs> And so they go dig up this kid juvenile papers from where her, him and his mother witnessed this murder. And this kid gave a statement to the police, his mama. So I'm saying, man, how they gonna shame this little nigga? If you want, us, you want our kids to stand on these mafia codes against their mama. Nigga, my mama say, who did this? Mama, you want me to, mama ain't snitching. Mm -hmm. She go get the law, you nigga. Yeah. So you want our kids who really don't know these street rules, codes, and ethics to stand on this no snitching against the pain of their mother. And if their mother is in the presence of them, crying like my mama. Now we back. Okay. Let me just say this. I want to give a shout out to my boy down there in Tag New Tennessee again. But my, I want y'all to hear something. The most thing I want y'all to hear about is the situations 
that everybody sit around and cry about. Man, you said about Gilly. Man, you said about. We got to stop. We got to stop, homie. I mean, you know, everybody can have their opinions about something. It's just that when people go overboard, I'm like, dang, it's not that serious. Because half y'all don't care about nothing. Half y'all don't even care about nobody. Half y'all don't even care about y'all self. But y'all to sit around here and make it seem like y'all love these celebrities. Man, y'all don't even love your mama. You don't even love your kids. You don't love your daddy. You don't love nobody. But y'all act like y'all really sitting around here and y'all really love these celebrities, man. Come on, homie. They ain't getting y'all through hard times. They ain't helping y'all get through nothing. So my thing is, hey, y'all see what time it is. You know, I want y'all to go down there. And that, I want y'all to get ready to go, go over there to Gotta Eat Podcast. Go over there, subscribe to them boys, man. Chag Newton. Let's get them boys jumping. And at the same time, man, we're going to keep on pushing the narrative, man. Keep on exposing the truth, man. We're going to keep on dropping down the number of jewels, man. Whoever pick it up, man. Get what, man? Y'all live well, man. Man, we feed the brain, we feed the mind, we feed the soul, all in the name of good game, Jack. Square business. So hit that like button, subscribe, share, man. Let's get this thing going, man. I told y'all, man, hey, you got to stay active in order to win. A person that's not active cannot win. You cannot win if you're not active, you get what I'm saying. So with that being said, man, let me just sit back and... uh. Y'all want to hear y'all comments. Please comment. Let me hear what y'all got to say. I'm out here.